we're off. Hi, my name's Alex. Uh, we are going to show you how to put your Smith Digital Speedo uh, into your standard bay window pod, as it were. Um, so, this is obviously your standard bay window pod. I took this out of my van yesterday. Um, I disconnected all the lights, twist them, they come straight out, disconnected the wiring connections, disconnected the speedo cable. Uh, you've got the four screws around the corner. Um, and don't forget to take the heat levers out first. Um, so that's nice and easy and comes out in one piece. Uh, and then with your Smith digital speedo, you'll have the uh, speedo. Uh, you've got a cable, uh, which this will plug into a joining cable that then goes onto the speedo cable itself. You've got a calibration button um, and you've got the wiring loom for it. Um, so this is our lead between, so that will plug onto the uh, cable end that comes out of your new speedo and this is your drive gear as it were, so this will go onto a speedo cable uh, which will go down to your front left wheel like would be absolutely normal on a bay window. Um, so the first thing we will be doing is you've got these three brassy looking nuts, which may not be brassy on yours but are on mine. Um, these three hold the instrument cluster together, hold the, uh, the fuel gauge on there. So you're looking at one, two, three, four, five around the outside, the silver ones that we're just going to uh, quickly undo. Right, so with those five undone, you can lift out your uh, your fuel gauge and your original speedo. Um, so for now, what I'll do is I'll put the uh, dash pod at the back here. So <clears throat> next thing to do, obviously, will be to remove your original speedo and replace it with the new one. So if we slip this over, uh, you've then got two screws above the drive gear um, that you can use. So that will then literally just pull out. So you can leave your original one off to one side. So you then got the back of your uh, your gauge here. Obviously, the writing needs to be the right way up. So the VDO written on the left, the VW logo, all the writing needs to be the right way up. And you get one of these in your box. Now this is your drill template. Um, now what you would do is this has got a sticky back on it. You peel your sticky back off, stick that over the top. Now you'd line up your two original holes with the screws that you've just taken out and the centre hole using the black holes on the picture and then you drill these three extra holes with a, a 3.2 drill bit. Um, the drill bit size is written on the sticky uh, so that makes it nice and easy and as I say you just peel off the back, stick that on, drill the three holes using the template um, and then <coughs> that would be on there obviously with three drilled holes, peel that off and as you can see I've got my three holes already drilled on this one uh, but they're, they're on here. Um, so the next thing we'll be doing is sticking your speedo through the hole. Now what you want to be careful with is obviously this has got the needle on the front now it can take a little bit of abuse but do be careful with those needles in the front so what I'm going to do is just lay this out nicely so I can slide the whole lot through a cable at a time try and keep my face facing upwards so that it doesn't get any damage slide the grommet through Right, so you see everything's now through the hole. On the back of your digital speedo, you've got three white plastic pegs, which then 
it says. And you've got three black plastic pegs which go over the top. One, two, and third. And now, uh, this Oops, try and put it upside down. It doesn't work. So, you've then got your plastic pegs roughly over the holes. Um, Over. Now what I'd do is I'd get the screws go through and I'd just get them started in there. Don't actually do them up tight yet until you've got all three started so you know they're all in the right place. So it is literally as easy as that. That's all screwed in and together. Um, <coughs> then obviously you'll be putting it all back into your dosh, dash, dosh pod, dash pod. Um, so <coughs> we could move this the right way up. Slide that over our dash. Again, you're just putting in the five the M6 headed nuts, uh, bolts on, that we took out. Five of those, one, two, On the upside down. You've then got your original fuel gauges in there, but your new digital speedo is uh, all in your original cluster.